hello friends welcome to my channel this is Charan in this video I will show you in PHP how to create a database dynamically in MySQL PHP my admin database enter database name I'm entering the database name Charan DB I want to create this database name in MySQL PHP my admin database if you notice in this panel there is no any ChannelDB database. Let's reload this panel. See, there is no any ChannelDB. Let's create submit. See here we got a message database created successfully. Let's reload this panel again. See, notice ChannelDB is added. Let's create one more. At this time I'm creating XYZ database name. Submit. Database is created successfully. Reload the panel. Here we got the XYZ. Suppose I want to create Charon DB database again. When I click submit, see here we got a message already database is exist. Cannot create database Charon DB. When I reload, see there is no any duplicate Charon DB database here. That's it. If you are a first time visitor to my channel, please subscribe to get the latest updates. I just logged into my SQL PHP my admin database. If you notice in the left column, these are the databases. Now I want to create a new database dynamically in PHP coding using my SQL method. Let's start the coding part. For this video tutorial, I am using Notepad++. First, we'll create a simple HTML5 code to add one text box control and one button control. So HTML, I'm closing the HTML body, body, above body, I'm adding header section. Now in this body section, I'm adding center tag. I'm closing center tab H1 how to create database dynamically into MySQL PHP my admin. I'm closing the H1 tab. using php code horizontal line after the horizontal line i'm adding enter database name i'm adding the input text box element input type is equals to text and one button control input type is equals to submit name is equals to value value is equals to submit and one important thing we need to add the form tag between this body section form because the form method is a post I'm closing the form tag the form method is equals to post after adding the method post to the form tag now in the text box and button controls I'm adding the important property called name which is DB name and name is equals to submit and friends here the form tag let's save this file save computers I'm adding in C drive I'm saving this in the root folder www create database dynamically dot php 
Now after saving this file, before writing the coding part in PHP to create the database, first we'll check the basic output how it looks at designing path on the browser. And here is the output of that simple HTML code which contains the header tags and text box control and button control. Now my aim is I will enter one new database name and I click submit. I want to create a new database in this MySQL PHP my admin database. So let's write the coding path. Notepad plus plus above HTML. I'm writing the coding part PHP. If is set dollar underscore post between square brackets, I'm adding the submit button name between double quotes. After that, we'll write the connection string variables dollar con variable is equals to mysql underscore connect method the connect method first takes a local host comma and the second parameter is a username i am adding the default username of php my admin which is a root comma i don't have any password so I'm leaving blank here. If you have any password, please enter that one. Now the next step is, if the connection string is failed, I want to display the error message. If not dollar con, if the variable connection is not connected, die connection failed dot my sql underscore connect error number after that let's create a database i'm adding sql query is equals to between double quotes create database dot dollar underscore post between square brackets I'm adding the text box name DB name because we are entering the database name from the text box control so I'm adding the DB name if my SQLI underscore query method which takes the first one is a connection object dollar Con, comma and the second one is a string query a string query is a dollar SQL query let's copy this one and paste here once the database is created successfully I want to display the message echo database created successfully else echo in the else part if the database is already exist I want to display the message already database is exist my sql underscore error I'm adding this connection object dollar con after that let's close the connection string my sql underscore close method dollar con that's it we have done the complete coding part let's check once again if we set here one more bracket required let's call query create database make sure give gap here otherwise you'll get an error after that 
I hope so. Let's save this file. Let's create a new database in PHP MyAdmin database dynamically. Enter database name. I'm entering the database name Chenan DB. I want to create this database name in MySQL PHP MyAdmin database. If you notice in this panel, there is no any Chenan DB database. Let's reload this panel. See, there is no any Chenan DB. Let's create submit. See here we got a message database created successfully. Let's reload this panel again. See notice Charan DB is added. Let's create one more. This time I'm creating XYZ database name. Submit. Database is created successfully. Reload the panel. Here we got the XYZ. Suppose I want to create Charan DB database again when I click submit. See here we got a message already database is exist. Cannot create database Charan DB. When I reload, see there is no any duplicate Charan DB database here. That's it.